due scrutiny on Supreme Court Justice Clarence Thomas and his wife, Ginny Thomas. Tonight, the Washington Post now reporting that Ginny Thomas received tens of thousands of dollars in fees through a judicial activist who specifically asked that her name be left off the billing paperwork. Here's Terry Moran. For several years, Jenny Thomas, wife of Justice Clarence Thomas, was paid tens of thousands of dollars for consulting work in a secretive arrangement brokered by a powerful conservative activist who specified that Jenny Thomas's name should be left off billing records, according to the Washington Post. The Post reports that Leonard Leo, the influential founder of the Federalist Society, a key group in the Republican effort to make the federal judiciary more conservative, arranged for Ginny Thomas to be paid at least $80,000 through a nonprofit group he advises. Leo told that group not to record her name, writing, no mention of Ginny, of course. That same year, the nonprofit group filed an amicus brief in a landmark voting rights case before the Supreme Court. Clarence Thomas, already under scrutiny for taking lavish vacations courtesy of a billionaire GOP mega donor who also bought Thomas's mother's house and helped pay for his great nephew's private school. Democrats and some Republicans are calling for a cleanup at the court. The drip, drip, drip of these destructive disclosures is going to destroy the United States Supreme Court. In a statement to the Washington Post, Leonard Leo said that Ginny Thomas's work was, quote, invaluable and added that her work did not involve anything connected with the court's businesses. The Thomases, when asked for comment by the Post, did not respond. David? Terry Moran, who's covered the court for years for us. Thank you, Terry. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.